Hi, my name is Tammy with What's in the Box, a show where we open up boxes. Today we got Bow Candy, which I'm really excited about because it should have candy in it. It's candy from around the world. It starts at $15, which I'm hoping is worth it because candy around the world sounds awesome. I have a huge sugar tooth. Oh. <laughs> These look awesome. Oh, and cookies. Candy and cookies. Oh, lots of cookies. Cookies. <laughs> I think they should call this a cookie box because there's a lot of cookies in here. Ooh, I'm gonna try this one. I'm gonna totally pronounce all of these wrong. Goral Goralki. Coco Sawe. Smack Po Brezki. I think it's a cookie. I will let you know. This is like the best day ever. Mmm. This is bomb. It's like a wafer cookie with chocolate and kind of has a coconut flavor. So if you like coconut, this is really bomb, which I love coconut. Oh my God. I'm gonna get fat doing this. It's gonna be worth it. This is a winner. I'm gonna eat all the cookies first. This one came with two of these. I can actually pronounce this. Dutch Bakery Windmill Cookie. Dutch Spice Cookie, Spec ooh, Speculous. That's what they make cookie butter out of. Okay, I, th I think I'm gonna like this one. If you've never had cookie butter, get it at Trader Joe's. It's awesome, but only get the crunchy kind. Do your winner. It's kind of like a crunchy cinnamon cookie. I don't know why I'm saying kind of, because that's exactly what it is. It's a crunchy cinnamon cookie. Kind of like gingerbread, but better. You could probably make your own cookie butter by just like mushing a bunch of these up and adding like, I don't know, maybe like coconut oil. I'm gonna try that one day. This is another one I can pronounce. Get up and go smart energy cookie. Chocolate chip, one shot, energy in energy product zero coffee taste i'm guessing this has coffee in it some sort of energy thing i don't know what's a shot of i'm hoping it's a shot of vodka but we'll never we'll find out a girl can dream okay it's been a long day the only thing that would make this package better if it came with like a little bottle of like oh like um like bailey bailey's irish cream with these cookies that would be bomb Okay, it's soft. That is a good sign. It's very good. I'm really curious what they put in it to make it energy. I don't know, but there's, a, there's sugar in it, so that's probably the energy that's coming from here. It's very good. It's like a, yeah, a soft chocolate chip cookie. I apologize for eating with my mouth open. Okay, I wanna try these. Stoby Flips. They look like some sort of chip with peanuts and vitamin crust. They're kind of like Cheeto Puffs, but with like a hint of peanut. I don't know. They're kind of cool. I don't know, I kind of wish they were more, I mean, maybe I'm just partial to cheese, but they're still pretty good. I mean, I'll eat them. I'm still eating them. So that must mean something. They kind of look like peanuts. They just like little mini Cheeto Puffs. Now all the grandma candy. Bronhi. No idea what this is. Well, it looks kind of caramelly. This is soft too. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not a big fan. If you like licorice, this is it for you. <laughs> if you don't like licorice like me, it's gonna be a little painful. Yeah, definitely very licorice-y. That was very misleading. I thought it was gonna be a caramel. I hope this doesn't ruin the taste of everything else. I shouldn't eat that last. You know, I'm gonna eat this one because it looks like it's banana flavor and I like banana, but not that much. So hopefully the licorice won't ruin that. But this is called Kiki. It kind of looks like a Star Wars. Oh man, it's lemon. You know, it kind of washes out the licorice taste. It was very juicy. Definitely like a Starburst, but a little more chewy. So it comes with different flavors. That was lemon. This one's strawberry. Same thing. Mmm. Yeah, this is good. Just like a Starburst, but chewier, if we can imagine that. And the orange one, I'm sure it's gonna be also good. I'm really bad at unwrapping these. Mm -hmm. They're very juicy. I like them. So these are definitely the ones that look like the ones my grandma has. They're hard candies, they come in several flavors. This one I'm hoping is like cherry or like strawberry. I'm hoping they're the ones that kind of have like a gooey center. I don't think it's strawberry. Maybe it is, maybe I just still have the orange in my mouth. I lied, I think it is strawberry. I'm gonna try to bite it find out if it has the center. It does, it does kind of have the gooey center. <laughs> I'm gonna have so many cavities after this. <laughs> It's gonna be worth it. So I think you're supposed to suck on them, but it still tastes good if you chew on them. Um, that's all of them. So I think my favorite out of all these, I really like this wafer. 
I think this is the best one, but I'm partial to chocolate. I mean, I'll eat any candy you give me, obviously, because I ate all this. But this one was the best. This was like the wafer cookie with the chocolate and the coconut. Out of the candy candies, I think the little Starburst things, the little Kiki, those are really good. They're extra chewy and they have really good flavor. I want to send a big thanks to Bow Candy for giving us candy friends snacks from around the world. They're all delicious, except maybe the licorice, but some people like that. If you want to get your own delicious candy from around the world, click the link below at Bow Candy starting at $15. As always, make sure to like, subscribe, and share. Here at What's in the Box, we have a monthly giveaway. Please check out the link below so you can enter to win a curated box. Join us next time! This was Sammy! Bye! Really cute packaging. It's the like the little Japanese bento box wrap you always see in the animes. Oh, it's very pretty. It's very elegant. Smaku from Japan.